Now I decree and declare by the power that raised Christ from the dead, I activate every virgin dimension in your life that is required for you to rise and do greater works. Receive that grace now in the name of Jesus. Let the spirit of prayer and supplication like never before rest upon your life. I impart upon you this moment the spirit of wisdom. Receive it in the name of Jesus. From today you begin to make extraordinary decisions that move your destiny forward in the name of Jesus Christ. I decree and declare God's servant Bishop Oedeko will say there is the spirit of faith and he came to a people, a generation as a representation of the spirit of faith that came from Papa Hagin and was imparted upon him. I decree and declare in the name of Jesus, the faith that works, that moves mountains, may that grace be imparted upon you now. And I pray for you. I have taught you that there is a prophetic dimension to wealth. Wealth answers to value. Wealth answers to productivity. Wealth answers to relationships. Wealth answers to a lot of things, financial intelligence. However, we are not left without an advantage. I decree and declare the kind of wealth that your hand is here to handle. May my God, the giver of all good things, surprise you with it in this season. Number five, the force of influence. For some of you, by reason of this impartation, nobody has known you now. But between now and the end of the year, in the name of Jesus, let the grace for visibility rest upon you. Let the grace for visibility rest upon you. May kings hear about you. May nobles hear about you. May heads of government hear about you. In the name of Jesus Christ. The grace that announces your gift, the grace that announces your value, the grace that announces your contribution, whether in business or in whatever area, I decree and declare, everyone who is seated in the position of authority, who needs to hear about you, may the angels speak to them about you. May God use men to speak to them about you. Finally, in the name of Jesus, by the privilege of the apostolic and the prophetic, every door that has been closed over your life, stopping you from making destiny advancement, in this year of open doors, I command those doors be open now. Be open now. I place a prophetic word on your head that everywhere you go, let it compel men to favor you. Let it compel men to favor you. Hear me? Any long-standing battle that you have been fighting in the name of Jesus, as Moses lifted his hands for victory, I stand as a privileged servant of God and I lift up my hands before Jehovah Nissi. May that battle come to an end now. May that battle come to an end now. There are some of you who have not laughed this year. You have watched others laugh, but laughter has been far from you. It's from one tragedy to another. Just when you think you are lifting your head, another problem comes. I say it again. The Bible says, and by a prophet, the Lord God brought Israel out of Egypt. And by a prophet, they were preserved. I stand in the name of Jesus, the one who calls and anoints men. I place grace on your life. Rise above every challenge. Rise above every limitation. Therefore, Koinonia, I speak to you. Arise and shine. Arise and shine. Arise and shine. Arise and shine in the name of Jesus Christ. Thank you, Jesus. Give Jesus a big hand clap. It is done.
in the name of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah.